everybody, welcome back to the channel. Coming to you from nice snowy northern Minnesota. This is the, uh, not the first snow of the year, but uh, one of the first ones that might actually stick around because temps are supposed to be like highs of 20 degrees for the next week. So yeah, hopefully the snow will stick around and get some uh, future video for you guys. So today what we're going to be taking a look at is another accessory for my four-wheeler. Um, I got the light bar on here, which you can see here. Um, this bugger works really well. Turn the key on for you. Uh, where's the switch? There you can see that bugger. But, so I need something to hold my gear. Otherwise, all I got is this tank back here. So I was looking for a front rack bag or a rear rack bag. And I did a lot of looking. I didn't really see very much. Or very, I didn't see very many bags that I actually liked, but I did find one that I liked after a lot of searching. And the only problem is that one was made basically discontinued like a year or two years ago, something like that. So I finally found one on eBay, picked it up for a decent price, and let's take a look at it. Got it right here, bag keeping it out of the it out of the snow for you. Oh, that wouldn't be good. So this is this is a front rack bag. So this here is the Ogeo uh, Burrow or Ogeo Burrow, whichever way you want to pronounce that. Um, it's supposed to be a front rack bag. So it's supposed to go on the front of the four wheeler like this. Um, it's got uh, these straps here, loop around your rack or underneath on your rack right here. And it's got these buckles right on the front here, which you just undo these two, one here and one here, and then it opens right up. There is, so there is no zipper on here, which I'm a little disappointed in, but I'm going to try it out. There's a zipper right here which leads to the foam uh, support, basically. But there is like a dust seal on here, or a dust gasket, as they call it. So this is supposed to help keep the uh, dust and water and stuff like that out if you're riding. Um, we'll see how well that works. It looks like it should work pretty good when the lid is down like this, but um, I don't know. After a while, if it doesn't work, what I might do is have someone uh, professionally sew in a zipper, a heavy duty zipper along here, or maybe a lot in here. I'll talk to somebody, see if we can. But I think doing a zipper would kind of be hard because you got you got this lip right here, so it'd be hard to do a zipper and get your hand in there to actually unzip it. So I'll give it a try, see how it goes. It's the uh, B U R R O by Ogio. Um, if you're gonna find these, you probably have to find them on eBay. It's got a pocket right up here. Slide your cell phone in. You want to slide your cell phone in. So I'll give you some, uh, hopefully, a little bit close-up view of it. Um, for my four-wheeler, I am actually going to be mounting this on the back rack because, as you can see, it's going to be sitting right on top of my light bar otherwise. And I don't want it on top of the light bar. So I think I am actually going to mount it, mount it backwards on here and have it like this. So if I need to open it, it'll open up that way. Then I'll just strap it down. So yeah, that's a look at the uh, Ogeo rear mount. It's supposed to be a front mount or rack bag, but I'm going to mount it in the rear. So let's get you guys a close up view of it. See what you think. Hopefully the audio and video is plenty good for you guys. And it is snowing out fairly decent. It's a beautiful looking bag though. Looks really nice. Here's these buckles, kind of heavy duty buckles that you got to open it and close it. Uh, here's a zipper compartment right here. Zip that back closed. And there's your inside. And this divider does come out of here. It's just in here with uh, Velcro. 
And there's your zipper here for the foam that's on the top to help give it a little support and stuff. Here's this dust gasket. You want to see that? So that seals up nice actually. It fits real nice on the top part when you close it like this. As you can see how that actually fits up snug against there. So with the buckles on there it should it should give a pretty good seal on it, I would think. Um, yeah. Tell me what you think guys. What else do you want to see for videos on the channel? I'd uh, actually like to go wheeling in the snow and get some good video for you guys. That'd be fun. But I need somebody to go out with me to help get the video. They can't hardly ride and film by myself unless I'm doing GoPro, first person GoPro footage. But that gets a little bit complicated at times. I'm trying to get some different uh, shots and stuff rather than just first person. But we'll see. Um, loving the four wheeler, loving the EPI clutch kit, turning the uh, Sedona mud and laws over just fine. So, all right, can't wait for a little more snow. Hopefully, not too cold of temperatures this winter. And yeah, stay tuned, guys, for more. Um, I'll post a link to the bag if I can find one on Amazon. I am an affiliate member, might get a little commission if you guys buy through the link, but I don't believe they're on there. So, because like I say, it is a discontinued item. But ATV World, if you're listening, can you guys please like make bags like this again? Something that's like a nice, like a nice storage compartment bag for the front or back, and that's actually waterproof. Um, so a guy can throw camera gear in there, GoPros, and say throw a drone in there, like a Mavic, um, stuff like that. I know Mavics have their own case, but be nice to have a decent bags again. I looked all over and I couldn't find anything that looked really nice. I like this more sturdy, sturdy approach to uh, the bags, you know? That way they have a little support. A lot of them are just kind of flimsy. If you fill them up with your gear, then they're fine. But take your gear out and they just kind of crumple all up into a ball. So uh, any manufacturers, if you got a bag you want me to check out, uh, contact me, PM me, whatever give you my shipping address to do a review on your product um, let me know but yeah till then that's the bag I will be using along with this uh, tank bag which was just from Amazon super easy fits over the fits over the gas tank just right over that and works good boy the snow is adding up quick all right guys I gotta get my camera out of the snow here and we will catch you guys in a future video. Thanks for watching. Favorite, like, share, and subscribe. And as always, peace out. We'll see you later. Enjoy the winter.